Hello everyone. Today I am going to tell how to find the number of wor words of four letters by using these given words. So here I am going to tell the solutions of these three problems. Uh, generally, if you want to find the number of words by using all the letters, then you have to find the permutations of these letters by the permutations of the repeating letters. Generally, we use that method. But here in this case, you have to write the four letter words. So here in these type of problems, you have to do generally uh, three or four cases you have to use. So uh, if you see these type of problems here, these two are almost similar, but the third one is little bit different. If you see the solutions, then you will understand how to do these type of problems. The first one is how many words can be formed by taking four letters at a time out of the letters of the word mathematics. So here you have to find the number of words of four letter words by using these letters. So here uh, if you observe these letters M-A-T-H-E, M-A-T-I-C-S. So here some letters are repeating M-M and A-A and T-T. So you can here write in three ways. Uh, the first case you can write in different letters. If you see here I-M-H-A. So different letters you can write. And in the second case, you can write same letters and different letters. Two letters are same and two letters are different. In the third case, you can write two letters are same and two letters are same. So by using these three cases, you can find the number of words of four letter words. Now, moving to the solution. Here, these are the letters, given letters in this word and uh, just write the repeating letters first here and then the re remaining letters, different uh, letters you can write here. And uh, out of these, the first case, in the first case, you have to write the letters, four letters are different letters. So, from these letters, you have to choose only one letter, for example, M, M. So, you have to choose only one M and here A, A, you have to choose only A like that. So, repeating letters, you have to choose only one letter and the remaining letters just right here. So, now the number of letters here are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Generally, the number of letters here are 11, but uh, if you re removing these letters, repeating letters, then you will get 8 letters. So, by using these 8 letters, you have to write 4 letter words. So we know that uh, by using eight letters, uh, if you want to write four letter words, you have to use the permutations, you have to find the permutations. Therefore, the required number of words is equal to 8P4. So out of eight letters, you have to write four letter words. So 8P4 is eight, fa eight factorial by eight minus four factorial. That is, if you find this solution, then you will get 1680 words. So this is only in the first case, the number of words are 1680. 80. So these are the examples you can write with different letters I M H A T E M S like this. You can write the different letters. So these letters, these words are 1680. If you go to the second case, so here uh, you have to write the four letter word with two same letters and two different letters. In this case, two letter words are two letters are M M A A and T T. You can see here two letters are these uh, pairs. So out of these three pairs, you have to use only one pair. So that is three C one, and here two different different letters. So once you take out one pair, so so the remaining letters are H E I C S N you can take any of these letters. A you can take and T. If you write MM, then you can write A or T. If you write A here, then you can take M or T. So like that you have to arrange. So total here are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. These are the different letters. And you have to take out two letters from this. So 7. 5 plus these two, that is 7. So here once you write the two letters here, then the remaining letters are 7. So like that you have to calculate. Then here out of three groups, you have to write only one group. Why I am telling here groups? Because here if you choose any two letters out of these six letters, it is difficult. You can write M, T and A, T also. That's why you have to 
take like three groups out of three groups you have to write only one group like that you have to write so this is 3c1 and here the remaining letters are 7 so 7c2 why we are writing combinations here because whenever uh, you have these type of problems like different cases in the same word like here two same letters and two different letters then you have to use combine you have to find first combinations then for each combination you have to find permutations if they give directly like in the first case different letters so you can directly calculate uh, the permutations but in this case in the word there are two different like two same letters and two different in this type of problems you have to find first combinations then you have to find permutations so first find these are the combinations and for each combination again you can write the permutations here four letter words so four factorial and two letters are repeating so by two factorial so four factorial by two factorial for one combination for example this is one combination for this combination you can write these many words then total combinations those are 3c1 into 7c2 for these combinations you can write if you multiply with this that is the required number of words is 3c1 into 7c2 into 4 factorial by 2 factorial so in this case second case if you calculate this you will get 756 words And now in the third case, two letters are same and two letters are same. So here there are no different letters. So here also you have to change two letters same, two letters same. So there are three groups of two letters, same letters. So out of these three groups, you have to write two groups. So here you have to write the combinations 3C2. Out of three groups, two groups here you are writing. Then uh, the letters are four letters. So, out of three groups use two. So, that is 3C2. But each combination, again, you can write the permutations. Four factorial, four letter words. So, four factorial by here, two letters are repeating here. So, two factorial. Again, two letters are repeating. So, two factorial. Like this, you have to find. If you see the example, for example, if you, this is one combination. For this combination, you can write the permutations like this. Number of permutations you can write. So, now the required number of words is 3c2 into 4 factorial by 2 factorial into 2 factorial. If you solve this, then you will get the number of, the required number of words in this case is 18. Now, add all these number of words. The first case, that is 1680. And in the second case, it is 756. And in the third case, 18. If you add, then the total number of required number of words is equal to 1680 plus 756 plus 18, that is 2454. This is second problem. This is also similar to the previous one, but little bit different here. The number of four letter words that can be formed using the letters of the word Barak, B A R R A C K. So here, four letter words you have to form and uh, by using this uh, word. So, if you see here, uh, in this word, AA is repeating, RR is repeating. So, only two groups here. This is the difference uh, from the previous one. And in the previous problem, there are three groups here, two groups. So, in the first case, directly you can find four different letters. So, four different letters means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So, 5P4, five that is 120. And in the second case, two same and two different. Two same means here only two groups. Out of two groups, you have to write only one group. Because 2 same, that is 1 group. So, 2C1 into, once you write 1 group, then the remaining are 1, 2, 3, 4. So, out of 4 letters, you have to write 2 letters. 2 different letters, that is 4C2. This is 1 group from 2 groups, same letters. And here, different letters. Into, these are the combinations. You have to multiply with permutations. For each combination, you will get this number of permutations. That is 4 factorial by 2 factorial because 2 letters are repeating here. 2 same. Now you will get uh, the number of words, the required number of words is 144. The third case, same, 2 same, 2 same. So here there are only 2 cases, 2 groups. So this is the difference between previous one and uh, this one. In the previous case, 3C2. Out of 3 groups, you have to choose only 2, two groups because 4 letter word, 2 groups. Here, two same, two same. So, two C2 out of 
two groups, you have to choose only two groups. So, 2C2 into 4 factorial permutations, 4 letter 1 by here 2 are repeating. So, 2 factorial, again 2 are repeating, 2 factorial. Now, you will get 6. Now, add all these values, then you will get the total number of required number of words is 270. Uh, this is the problem. This is a little bit different from the uh, previous uh, two problems. How many four-letter words can be formed using the letters of the word ineffective? So, here the difference is uh, three letters are repeating here. Uh, and two letters are repeating uh, I, I, F, F are repeating. And three letters are E, E, E. And these are the remaining different letters. So, in this case, you have to use four cases. In the previous, case, in the previous problems, you used three cases here, four cases you have to add. Why? Because here, if you see in the first case, different letters, four different letters. In the second case, two same letters, two different letters. In the third case, you can use three same letters and one different letters. This is a difference. And in the fourth case, two same, two same. So, like this, you have to find the number of words. In the first case, four different letters. So, similar to that, here there are uh, 7 letters, so 7 P4. Now, that is 840 in the first case. And in the second case, 2 same, 2 different. Here, there are uh, 3 groups. See, here E is repeating 3 times, but here you can take 2 letters of E also. That's why here 3 groups. Out of 3, you have to choose only 1 group. So, 3 C1 into the remaining letters are 1, 2, 3, 4. 5, 6. Here, e, if suppose if you choose this one, then you can take one, one letter from these two pairs. So, you can take those letters. If you choose this one, then you can take these two letters. Like that, you have to write the different letters. So, here the remaining are uh, 6 letters. 6 out of 6 different letters, you have to choose only 2 letters. Out of 3 groups, 1 group here. And out of 6 different letters, 2, le two letters you have to choose. So, 3C1 into 6C2 into uh, the permutations are 4 factorial by 2 factorial. Here, 2 letters are repeating. Now, if you calculate this, you will get 540. The second case. In the third case, 3 same and 1 different. 3 same letters and 1 different. But here, 3 same letters is only 1 group. That is E, E, E. Only 1 group. So, the required number of words is here 1, C, 1. Because out of 1 group, you have to choose 1 group only. Once you finish these 3 letters, only the remaining letter, only 1 letter you have to write. So, the remaining letters are, if you take I, F, N, C, T, V. Because already you chose this. So, you have to take the remaining then those are 6, C, 1. Out of these 6, you have to choose only one letter. See, this is the difference uh, from the previous problems. And here, just listen. Here, uh, these are 3 letters. So, 1, C, 1. one Out of one group, 1. Already 3 letters finished. So, only one you have to choose. One different letter. So, 6, C, 1 into 4 factorial by here, 3 letters are repeating. So, 3 factorial. That is 24. And in the fourth case also similar to the previous one, here 2 same, 2 same. So, 3 groups, 3C2 into 4 factorial by 2 factorial into 2 factorial, that is 18. Like this, you have to calculate. Now, the total number of required number of words is 1422. Now, please do these problems. The answers.